This story is from a time when the internal affairs of England and China were bad. Both countries want to strengthen themselves internally so that when war breaks out, the country with the strongest technology will win the war. A lab in England that is deep underground features a scientist named Vincent. Vincent is confronted by a soldier named Paul who has been shot in the head and is completely dead, but Vincent has repaired his brain with his cybernetic implant. Vincent talks to the soldier but he doesn't respond. Vincent asks the scientist working with him to activate the implant in the soldier's brain. As she activates it, the soldier looks at Vincent. Vincent asks the soldier what is your name but he doesn't remember his own name he tells Vincent I want to meet my mother. Vincent asks him do you remember your mother's name do you remember your mother's face but the soldier remembers nothing. He was saying the same thing again and again that I have to meet my mother, I have to meet my mother. Vincent doesn't pay much attention to him, Paul hugs him from behind while Vincent is talking to his colleague. Vincent tells him to sit down but he attacks Vincent and injures him. And at the same time he kills the woman who was a scientist, then a soldier comes there but Paul snatches his gun and kills him too. Now he starts to kill Vincent as well, but before he can kill Vincent, another soldier arrives and shoots Paul in the head, killing him, saving Vincent's life. Days after the accident, when Vincent has fully recovered, he visits many researchers and observes their work. There is a girl named Ava she introduces her artificial intelligence that she has recently created. When Vincent talks to Ava's artificial intelligence, it responds to Vincent in the same way that a human would. Vincent tells Ava that you have done a great job and taught him very well, but Ava tells him that I didn't teach him anything, he learns himself. Ava says that there are so many things we do every day that the computer learns itself. After hearing this, Vincent tells everyone that we will take a 10 minute break and everyone walks out. Now Vincent tells Ava not to waste your remaining 5 years here because your work is great and you are on right track. Whatever funding you have for your work, I will get you from the government. After hearing this, Ava realizes that Vincent works for the government. Ava asks Vincent do you build weapons for the government and Vincent says no I build intelligence machines for them and I built one such intelligence machine. Vincent also built a machine but it was not as intelligent as Ava's machine. Hearing this, Ava agrees to the job. Now the next day Ava goes to where Vincent's lab is. When Ava reaches there, a woman comes there and tells her that my son is inside. They won't let me see my son. Actually, this woman is the mother of a soldier named Paul who has died. His mother has not found her son's body yet so that woman comes here but she doesn't know that his son has been died. After this Ava meets with Vincent, a lot of soldiers are standing here. Ava noticed a mark on soldier's head these marks are as if they were all operated on at the same place. Vincent tells Ava that these are soldiers who suffered brain injuries during the war and we have operated on them and implanted them, which has improved their lives, their memory, but it also has a side effect because of the implant these people have lost their power of speech, meaning now these soldiers cannot speak. Here Vincent introduces Ava to Thomas. Thompson is the head of the whole project. Thompson asks Ava some politics related questions, Ava is unable to answer Thomas's questions well because Ava is not very good at politics. Vincent tells Thompson we hired Ava not for politics but for intelligence system. A man who has no hands named James is then brought in front of Ava, who is given artificial hands. After receiving the artificial hand, it becomes so powerful that it crushes the marble balls into sawdust. Ava is very impressed to see this, she says that she has never seen such powerful artificial hands before. James says to Ava can I touch your hand I haven't felt a human touch in a long time. Vincent stops him and says you don't have full control of your hands yet. But Ava says he'll take control, then Ava puts her hand on Jimmy's hand and Jimmy spins her away from Thompson and Winston. James tells Ava I need your help I'll see you in area 6. Now Thompson tells Ava that the intelligence machines we are building will look exactly like humans, they will look like Chinese, they will look like Pakistani soldiers, so that when there is a war, they can negotiate and not only fight, but they can also help humans. Our soldiers will not have to die because of these machines. Now Thompson leave and Vincent takes Ava with him he sets sensors on her head and asks couple of questions actually he is recording data of her memories. Vincent asks her what makes you happy, Ava says, when I find a solution to a problem, doing maths and dancing. Vincent asks Ava what are you afraid of and Ava tells him I'm afraid of spiders and clowns and cancer. Then he asks couple of more questions from her and she responds as every question. Ava asks to Vincent about area 6, Vincent says when soldiers got injured we repair them and keep them alive. Then Ava asks if you helped these soldiers then why you kept them like a prisoners and Vincent tells her I also don't know about this. But Ava has a clause because James told her to meet her in area 6. Ava goes to meet James but the soldiers come there and she has to come back. The next day, Vincent scans Ava's face completely because he wants to make a robot who exactly look like Ava, even though Ava doesn't want it. Vincent tells Ava not to go down again because there are a lot of secrets and I don't want your life to be in danger, 
Then Ava asks what's actually happening here. On this Vincent got angry and said you've to focus on your work. But the next day Vincent feels guilty and says sorry to Ava he tells her that I cares about you that's why yesterday I just tried to explain you. Here they have created the brain of the machine. Then the machine tells Vincent that Ava is still angry with you, which means that the machine can understand Ava and Vincent's feelings. On the other hand, Thompson sees in the recorded footage that Ava tries to copy the files of Area 6 from the computer, she installs a hacking device in it, and Thomas gets angry. This was done by Ava when Vincent was not in the lab and now Thompson has found out. Thompson now goes to where Ava and Vincent are talking to the machine brain. He asks the machine brain how we can beat China in a war and the machine gives him the exact answer. After this Vincent and Ava leave for home and the Vincent tells Ava that I don't like this place then Ava says why you work here if you don't like this place. Vincent tells her I have daughter she has syndrome disease and this disease patient can't walk properly and also can't speak and the patient's growth stops. Because it's a neurological problem and Vincent believes he can cure his daughter with a brain implant. Ava says you want to connect my brain cells with you daughter's brain Vincent said yes, that's why he scans Ava's brain. Vincent tells her that I didn't scan my daughter's brain yet then Ava says I'll help you in this but don't lie to me ever. And as they move forward, Paul's mother stands on the way, who thinks her son is still alive. Ava tells Vincent it's getting late and we should drop them. As Ava approaches her, it is not Paul's mother but a Chinese who attacks Ava, all of which Thompson is watching on his screen, which means that it was all done by Thompson, followed by the same Chinese. Shoots Ava, which kills Ava, but Chinese does not kill Vincent making Vincent suspicious of Thompson. Then Thompson tells Vincent that you are lucky our soldiers reached out and saves you, but Vincent knows Thompson is lying and also murdered Ava. Now Vincent successfully creates robot and he gives it appearance of Ava. Vincent has a full neurological scan of Ava so he knows what Ava likes and dislikes. He inserts Ava's neurological scan into the robot's brain, and when the robot is fully formed, no one can recognize that it is a robot. This robot is of a very soft nature, it does not have violence, but Thompson does not want that. So he leaves a spider in its mouth to scare it, which scares the robot, but Vincent says to stop it, then they remove the spider from there. But then Thompson sends a clown to her, which scares the robot and attacks the clown and kills it. Thompson then leaves and says the job is done. Actually, Thompson wanted to see if this robot could kill someone or not. Vincent asks the robot what did you do, she tells him it was a clown. Then seeing Vincent remove the mask from the clown's face, the robot says I didn't know that humans and clowns are the same. She asks Vincent to fix it but Vincent tells her that it is dead, which makes the robot very sad and Vincent tells her not to kill anyone. After today Vincent then goes to James but James can't speak anymore because he has an implant fixed in his brain Vincent tells him don't stress I'm working on it and I'll get you out of here soon. On the other hand, it is seen that since the robot killed the human, she has not spoken to anyone, she has become pause. Seeing this, Thompson sends a soldier named Suri to the robot. They also fixed implant in Suri's brain. When she touches it, the robot grabs her hand, then it seems as if the robot is talking to her, then the soldier walks away. When Vincent returns, he is told that a robot has left her lab that could be dangerous. They stop Vincent from going there but Vincent goes there and sees her doing the dance. When she sees Vincent she hugged him but Vincent leaves from there. Then robot approaches to Vincent. Vincent asks her why you hugs me robot says I saw a picture of your daughter in you violet and she says I know she is suffering that's why you're sad. Listening this Vincent become emotional and say I know you aren't a real human neither you are alive. Then robot says how can you this even you don't know that Thompson is alive or your daughter. Vincent tells her that they are humans, then she says you can only see their bodies not their souls same as it is you don't see my soul my feelings. Then soldiers came and Vincent tells them it's fine she is with me and soldiers leave. The next Thompson took robot in front of a man. This man is Chinese who killed Ava. Thompson orders to robot for killing him but she refused and said Vincent stops me doing violence. Thompson tells her if you don't kill him he will go after Vincent. Then Thompson open his hands and threw a knife in front of him and leaves the room. Man tried to kill robot but she defend herself and break his hand then killed him. Thompson is very surprised to see this, he understands that this robot is very advanced, but he wants the robot to obey him, but the robot refuses. When Vincent comes he sees that the robot is hidden under the table. He asked her what happened she says I don't like this place anymore but Vincent asks her about yesterday night she tells him that I killed a man if I don't kill him he killed me. Actually it's a Thompson plan and he traps this robot in it because he wants the robot to obey him. Thompson orders Vincent to change the robot's attitude but Vincent refuse and tells him that if we try to make a change in it maybe we can lose this robot forever, listening this Thompson agreed. Then Vincent comes to robot. Robot says you make me to cure your daughter Vincent replies her yes but you aren't alive. Robot says no I'm alive I'll always trust you. 
Actually Robot have feelings for Vincent she fall in love with Vincent. Vincent receives a call from hospital they tells him that your daughter is not in a good position. He reached at the hospital and scans his daughter brain then doctor take his daughter in operation theater. Operation wasn't successful and Vincent's daughter died. Vincent is very sad after this incident he come back to the lab and try to find a way on the computer that how can he fixed an implant of his daughter's brain in any machine but he couldn't find a way. Then Robot approaches to him and he asks from Robot how do you feel when you look at my face, Robot says you have to look it in my eyes for this. He zooms in on the camera and scans his eyes and sees that the Robot's eyes contain many images of Vincent, which shocks him. It's mean Robot have conscious she have feelings. Then Vincent tells everything to Thompson and says it is more than a machine. Thompson says we have to change its programming it may create many more machines of its kind that may pose a threat to humanity. Thompson says that we have to reprogram him and make him a machine so that he obeys Thompson's orders, but Vincent doesn't want to do that because Vincent knows he's alive. Thompson tells him that if you don't listen to me, I will delete your daughter's brain scan file, Vincent is forced to hear this. He goes to the robot and tells all this to which the robot gets ready. When Vincent opens her mind she got scared and say I don't want to die I'll become a good human because I'm not Ava or someone else it's only me. Vincent tells her to don't worry everything will be fine he removes the consciousness from her mind, from which she had feelings, now she has become a machine. Thompson reneges on his deal and orders machine to kill Vincent. Although machine seems at first to obey, a scientist alerts Thompson that the operation was a sham and it only disabled failsafe routines designed to destroy machine. Machine and the cyborgs rebel against the humans and free Vincent. From his computer console, Thompson disables half the cyborgs but Surrey, his cyborg aide, overrides his access before he can kill the rest. Thompson shoots and wounds Surrey but Machine corners him in his office. Wounded, he first orders her to obey, then begs for his life. Although Machine agrees not to kill him, she lobotomizes him, as he attempted to do to her. After leaving Thompson for dead, Machine downloads Mary's brain scan. Machine, Vincent and Surrey escape the base, outside, Vincent hands the base records to Dawson's mother and leaves to start a new life with Machine. In the final scene, Vincent talks to a computer virtualization of his daughter and she requests to play a game with her mother. Vincent hands the tablet to Machine, and she is then shown gazing alternately at the device and at a beautiful orange sunset over the Atlantic Ocean. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.